What's up, my Pervaded people? Happy Pervaded Tuesday. Uh, it's actually the weekend right before, but we're having some friends coming in um, later this evening here in about an hour or so. So I wanted to film this video. I was telling, telling y'all how we've been showing y'all, introducing the new snakes that we've got from Canova. And we have one more to show y'all. She's the powerhouse. She's the, she's the big dog. So let's go ahead and get into it. Go ahead and come over here and give her a look. There she is. She's looking real nice. All right, let me get her. So I wanted to, she just came out of shed too. It was another reason I didn't want to wait, you know, till actually Tuesday to film and stuff. I usually don't anyway, but wanted to get her. I think she's been out of shed for two days now. And she, as soon as she came out of shed, she slammed a nice big rat. And uh, she's just, she's been so good feeding. But yeah, we'll just get, check her out and I'll talk about her a little bit. She is a black pastel, possible super red stripe, fire, yellow belly, double head, desert ghost clown. And we in the business call that a powerhouse. I mean, she is such a cool animal to look out look at and she's got so much potential packed inside her genetic take a look at the belly nice clean peachy belly got some really cool stuff going she's so pretty such a nice belly and such a calm <clears throat> kind snake she's uh she's never struck at me once like the uh christina the uh spot nose confusion girl she's super feisty this one is Super calm, laid back. I love how the head has that reduced no pattern. Just light blushing on the side. I mean, on the back there. So cool. And uh, yeah, I just love the yellow belly, red stripe, rust look. You can tell that peach is kind of coming up again off of the belly and on the sides here, that flaming. She is so, so gorgeous. And you know, this is just like the other two we just showed you. I like how the pattern gets even more pronounced here on the tail you really see all that fuzzy mountain stuff going on just really cool looking oh and she's 50 percent het genetic stripe and i thought she was hype i thought she was 50 percent het hypo too but like i said i got a couple that are like that so i'll just mix it up she's only um 50 percent het cheese stripe so she, well um, as soon as i get that test going we're gonna send that off and get it rolling to make to uh check that out what's going on there but yeah, same same game plan for her is we're gonna get a nice powerhouse male in next year. So I know Cheetah's freaking out. And uh, we're gonna get them all paired up to that stud. And she is just so cool, so nice, such a good snake. She's eating so well. If you guys aren't keeping snakes yet, you don't get it. But if you are keeping snakes, you, uh, you definitely get it. How, especially with all pythons how good it feels when a snake's eating well and, or if a snake comes off a feeding strike or if they've just been struggling uh, rejecting meals you know not not necessarily a strike but she's just such a good feeder and that just makes you feel so good because you want to get that size on them and you know that they're comfortable in their tubs and just feeling super natural and that's that's what we really want so check out that dorsal stripe too love that stripe outlined by the black stays stays complete the whole time sometimes they get broken up a little bit but hers is completely through yeah guys just wanted to show show her off a little bit like i said do a quick little short video this week um give you all some eye candy to look at and uh yeah guys so this is the last snake out of the collection that y'all haven't done a deep dive on <laughs> other than pepe um and we'll probably bring him out some in some future some future uh episodes but yeah so we're gonna keep coming at you with the snake content and the and the rat content and everything. And if you wanna if you guys wanna request any video stuff, any questions you got going on, we've been interacting with a lot of y'all in the comments and we really enjoy that. We're up at uh 220 plus subscribers and you know that next goal, that next milestone we're looking at is 250. So if you like this, you know, subscribe, like, comment, and uh, if you've been watching it and you aren't subscribed yet, we'd really appreciate the subscription. And, uh, yeah, we're going to keep going, guys. Like I said, we're doing Saturday shorts and uh, Pura Vita Tuesdays. So we're going to be putting out content for you guys. And uh, we really appreciate you following along. So with this girl right here, we have a couple names in mind. But we're still mulling over them. Um, 
and we named Rogue. We named her based off of a um, comment, and uh, we'd really appreciate if you guys gave us some suggestions in the comments. We really liked Rogue, so um, yeah, if you see anything that comes to mind here, just any cool name, uh, don't be afraid to drop it in the comments. We'll, we'll think about it, and uh, if we pick it, you know, we'll shout you out um, in the next video, and uh, we really appreciate that. But yeah, get one little last look at her, that nice peach belly. Love that plain head. The sides are so crazy. The dorsal stripe. And she's putting size on. So that next, so that actually reminds me, the next video we do uh, will probably be a snake weigh-in. We did it with our um, original three snakes and Pepe. And uh, we'll do it with these guys too. I don't know if we'll do all of them as in like a, as an update, but we'll do these new ones. So we can mark it down, see what they're doing. And, uh, Cause they've all been eating pretty well and uh so they should be should be climbing up there but we're super excited we have one last little look she is so so nice such a nice snake to work with um i love opening her tub and just looking at her and seeing a good feeding response and everything but we'll go ahead and put her back up let her keep digesting that meal she had a couple days ago and uh she seemed to be doing really well in this um smaller tub as well and uh, I kind of like like them having them in here. They seem more secure and more confident. But yeah, guys, there she is. You let us know. So guys, really appreciate you watching. Try to do a quicker video. It'll probably be around the five minute mark, so nothing too crazy. Um, we're gonna enjoy a good weekend with our friends. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. We got rat stuff coming. We got snake stuff coming. We're super excited. We got Cheeto stuff coming. This is our this is our pup, Cheetah. He's the one in here you'll hear clawing at the door and crying sometimes. He's crying. Cause he wants all the attention and when we give rats and snakes attention, it's not him. Anyways guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. Like, subscribe, keep following along. We got a bunch more stuff coming. Shout out to Michaela behind the camera for always filming these. And uh, yeah, we'll catch you next time. Peace.